These Knowles instructors are carefully making their way across the middle fork of the Papoja River in Sinks Canyon. The method they're using is called the Triolian Traverse. We're building a Triolian Traverse, which we use uh, in the mountains to cross rivers. And it's almost June, and usually in June the rivers get high enough that there are places where the only way across for most people is, uh, is on a rope like this. But before they could get to crossing, it takes teamwork of at least five people to set up the ropes. One of us just swims the river, or maybe um, some people sneak across uh, climbing a tree or something like that. But we sneak someone across, we throw some ropes, and we use a tension system to make them as a big high line. Uh, it would work with one rope, but we usually use two for less sag, and, it, and it's easier for our, our novice students to build if we use two ropes. And so they can do this, and they, they make it tight enough that they can get across uh, without getting wet. So what does it feel like to scoot across that rope, just feet above the roaring Poposha River? It feels really cool. You're upside down, you're going hand over hand uh, across the river, and for our students, it's a great way to experience a different technical skill while they're out on a Knowles course. These people you see here are just some of the nearly 200 Knowles expedition instructors from around the world that have traveled to Lander this week for the faculty summit. They're uh, theoretically going to go out and teach this to, to novices, hopefully well enough that they can do it on their own. And the instructors would tend to be there, uh, but the, the, our ideal is that the students learn to do this well enough that they can do it and we're just standing in the background coaching instead of doing it for them. During the faculty summit, instructors are also learning about rock rescue and river crossing. This triolian traverse method is usually taught during mountaineering courses. It's a different risk management strategy and technical skill. Puts together a lot of different systems uh, and has a great culminating experience for those students on courses. And if you're wondering about the history behind the name, here's your answer. The Tyrol is, is, is a, a place in the Alps and uh, there must be spires there. Uh, and and uh, this was an interesting thing that they did and so the, the name caught on. This is Victoria Fergoso reporting for County10.com.